A very good morning to all. I am Dr. Prabha Dhandiyal from Department of Botany, Uttarakhand Open University. Today I am here with a topic classification of gymnosperm, which is for our learners of MSc first semester. This topic is from course MSc BOT 503 block 2. So let's start. The group gymnosperm is a very large class which includes both living and fossil forms. Due to ample records of fossil forms, the classification has become somewhat complicated. Several workers have classified gymnosperm differently from time to time. Among them, the important ones are as follows. The pioneer worker in this field were uh, Coulter and Chamberlain. They gave their classification in the year of 1917 and divided the gymnosperm directly into seven orders, which are Psychedophilic tails, Banity tails, Psychedales, Cordite tails, Ginkgo tails, Coniferales, and Knee tails. In the same year, Jeffrey recognizes two classes among gymnosperms, which are class Archegymnospermi, which includes all those gymnosperms that resemble from their general appearance and anatomy. They possess motile spermatozoids. He divided this class into five orders, which are order. Pteridospermy, which includes all extinct forms, primitive and that lived in Paleozoic period. The second order is Psychedioidea, which includes all extinct forms. The third one, Psychedales, includes extinct and living forms. The order Cordytales includes all extinct forms. And the order Ginkgoales includes extinct and only single living genera, that is Ginkgo biloba. The second class that is Metagymnospermy uh, includes plants which possess simple leaves and have no resemblance, resemblance to the ferns. Second, they possess non-motile male gametes and the pollen grains grow into a pollen tube. It includes two orders. The first order is order Coniferales which includes living genera like Pinus, Cedrus, Taxus, Protocarpus, Taxodium, etc. It also includes fossil genera. Order Nitales includes Ephedra, Netum, and Velvetia, and many other fossil genera. Sovert in 1919 divided gymnosperm on the basis of composition of wood. He divided the gymnosperms into two classes that is, Manozylic, when there is porous wood and loose te texture. The second class is Pycnozylic when the wood is compact. The former class that is Manozylic includes orders like Psychedales, Psychedioidales and Psychedophilicales, while the later includes Cordatales, Ginkgoales, Coniferales and Neetales. However, Chamberlain in 1934 divided the gymnosperms into two classes, which were further divided into orders with their respective characters such as class Psychedophyta. This class includes three orders. The first one is Psychedophilicales, which includes extinct forms and fossils. Then Psychedioidales, which includes both living and fossil forms, and Psychedales, which includes both living and fossil forms. The second class Coniferophyta includes four orders. Uh, these are Cordatales, it includes extinct order. Then ginkgo whales, it includes extinct and only one living representative that is ginkgo biloba. Then the order coniferales, which includes both extinct and living forms. And then neetales, which includes both living and extinct forms. In 1957, Didi Pant has proposed a classification of gymnosperms in which the group is divided into three divisions. The first one is Psychedophyta, second Clamidospermatophyta and the last one is Coniferophyta. An outline of Pan's scheme of classification of gymnosperm is represented by means of a flowchart. Here you can see that the gymnosperm is further divided into three divisions, the Psychedophyta, Clamidospermophyta and the Coniferophyta which are further divided into classes. The division Psychedophyta includes the classes like Tidospermopsida, Psychedopsida, Pentoxylopsida, and Banititopsida, which are further divided into orders. The second class, Clamidospermatophyta, is divided into class Nitopsida, which includes two orders like Nitales and Velvetiales. Similarly, the Coniferophyta 
includes four classes which are coniferopsida, ephedropsida and chignoscheopsida and the last one is texopsida which are further divided into respective orders. Here the division Sacadophyta includes classes uh, as I have told you earlier that it includes four classes and which are further divided into their respective orders. After that NGO in 1961 another renowned scientist classified gymnosperm and divided it into six divisions uh, like Tidospermatophyta, Sacadophyta, Ginkophyta, Coniferophyta, Natophyta and gymnosperm of uncertain affinities. Again, in 1965, K.R. Spawn classified gymnosperm in his book namely The Morphology of Gymnosperm which was based on Pelger and Melchior classification. He divided gymnosperms into three divisions which are Sacadopsida, Coniferopsida and Nitopsida. These divisions further divided into orders. Here, the division Sacadopsida contains order Tidospermales, which is having seven families. Then the order Banititales, which contains three families. And the order Pentoxylales, which contains only one family, that is Pentoxylaceae. And the last order Sacadales contains two families. Then the division Coniferopsida contains order like Cordytales, which includes three families. Then order Coniferales, which includes nine families. And then order Texas, which includes only a single family, that is Texas. And the last order Ginkgoes contains two families. Further, the division Nitopsida contains order like Nitales, which is having three families. In 1980, Taylor classified gymnosperms in six divisions as Progymnospermophyta, Tidospermophyta, Psychidophyta, Psychidioidophyta, Ginkophyta, Coniferophyta. In 1983, Stewart classified the gymnosperm mainly on the basis of the evidences available from the fossil records. He placed Progymnospermopsida, Gymnospermopsida and Nitopsida as distinct classes under the division Tracheophyta the vascular plants of kingdom planty. These two classes were further divided as the first division tracheophyta. Division tracheophyta contains class progymnospermopsida which contains three orders. Then the class gymnospermopsida contains 12 orders. Then third class nitopsida contains three orders. Further in 2011, Christine Hertz et al. proposed a new classification and linear sequence of the extant gymnosperms based on molecular and morphological and phylogenetic studies. They divided all extant gymnosperms. Extant gymnosperms means the gymnosperms which are presently here on the land into four subclasses, eight orders and twelve families which are as follows the subclass 1 that is Sacadidae contains order Sacadales and family like Sacadaceae and Zemiaceae. Second the subclass Ginkgo, Ginkgo, Ginkgoidae contains order Ginkgoes and a family Ginkgoaceae. The third subclass Nitidae contains order like Velvaceales and family Velvaceaceae. The order Nitales contains family Nitaceae and then the order Ephedrales contains a family Ephedraceae. Here the subclass fourth that is Pinidae contains order Pinaceae which uh, contain a single family Pinaceae and the order Orocaryales which contains two family uh, that is Orocaryaceae and Podocarpaceae. The order Cupressales contains three family that is Cydopitiaceae second cupressaceae and third one taxaceae so here our classification of gymnosperm is completed hope this will be helpful for you thank you so much